Hey, hey, Dr. Walter here. So uh, one of the questions I got asked for a stretch uh, demonstration is this. Um, this person says that, uh, that they hurt their back eight months ago, and right now, during the day, they feel 100%, so everything's great during the day, feels good, no back pain. Go to bed at night, wake up in the morning, and feels back pain. So is there a stretch to help with that? Well, uh, a couple things I wanna say before I show the stretch. Number one, if you had back pain for eight months and it's still persisting, it's not 100% resolved, you do need to get that checked professionally. Um, some kind of uh, testing done, check your spine, uh, maybe get x-rays, MRI if necessary. Uh, chiropractic is a great, great uh, uh, type of care that helps many, many people with back pain. Um, so uh, just consider that uh, if, if you've had chronic pain for uh, eight months now and it hasn't resolved. Um, the other thing too is what's the sleeping position like? So are you sleeping on your back, on your side, on your stomach? So if you're on your back or side, it's what I recommend, on your stomach I don't. And if you have um, a situation where you wake up in the morning with backache uh, and you felt fine going to bed at night, then what I recommend is a couple of things. Number one, lying flat on your back for one thing and uh, put a pillow under your knees. And uh, number two, if you are a side sleeper, sleep on your side and put a pill pillow between your knees. And if you go on my YouTube channel, uh, youtube.com forward slash Dr. Walter Salubro, I have a video that shows uh, sleeping uh, positions for people that have back pain or leg pain. So check that out. So here's a good stretch uh, for you to do in the morning if you wake up with a sore back from uh, sleeping uh, throughout the night, okay? So I'll use this bench over here, this carpet table on this side. So follow me here. So in the morning before you actually get out of bed, uh, you're on your bed, lie flat on your back, and you're gonna do what's called, uh, these are called the knee to chest stretches. So they really help stretch the lower back area, provide some relief before you get up off your bed. And then I'll show you a proper way to actually get off your bed so you prevent uh, further injury to your back. So check this out. So you're on your bed, you're lying down, and before you get up, grab your knee, pull it to your body, and you're gonna hold for 10 seconds. So pull this way, hold 10 seconds, Repeat that three times. Do the opposite one. Hold 10 seconds. Repeat that three times. And then do doubles. Hold 10 seconds. Repeat three times. And then when you get off your table, uh, off your bed I mean, go to your side like this. On your side, feet together, feet down, hands on your bed, and you push yourself off like that so you come up in a nice neutral position and stand, okay? So easy, easy stretch you can do in the morning if you have an achy back. Uh, when you wake up in the morning, stretch it. Uh, like I just showed you, knee to chest stretches, and then a very important way to um, get up without aggravating your back. And then uh, if you go to the beginning part of the video, I explain the some sleeping postures and positions and how to use pillows to support your back while you're uh, sleeping at nighttime to uh, have, have your back more relaxed and less tense. And you can also put a heating pad in your lower back uh, before you go to bed for about 10 minutes because that will warm up your muscles, relax them, and then uh, prepare them to rest during nighttime. Hope you found that useful. I'll catch you in the next video.